So in this study, our goal was to improve outcomes in this uh, important patient population. Uh, historically, the majority of these patients have received radiotherapy, which is associated with late effects, including cardiovascular disease and secondary malignancies. So patients were treated with two cycles of ABDD. Those who were PET2 negative received six cycles of therapy without radiation. Patients who were PET2 positive were escalated to four cycles of BACOP and received radiotherapy consolidation. Overall, uh, there were 95 evaluable patients, 78% of whom were PET2 negative. In the PET2 negative group, uh, again, who received six cycles of ABVD only, the three-year progression-free survival uh, was 93%. In the patients who were PET2 positive and received uh, escalated BACOP and radiation, the three-year progression-free survival was 90%. So we felt that overall, all patients did well in this study, and we think our data supports uh, the omission of radiotherapy in patients who have an early PET2 negative response. And we hope this data will serve uh, as a comparison for future studies in this patient population uh, as we incorporate novel agents to uh, further improve outcomes.